Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, everyone. Good morning. This is going to be just a quick little snippet because I'm actually on break from work, but um, something has been burning in my spirit this morning. The Lord has really just been talking to me even while I've been at work. And so I just wanted to come on here for about five minutes, probably won't even be more than that. But as you know, um, this week, our key is movement. Good morning. Good morning, Sheila. So this week, our key is movement. We're using the key of movement. And um, we talked about on Monday, I talked about our definition of movement. Movement is an act of changing physical location or changing a position, a change or a development. And so I simply wanted to say, are you going are you ready for the movement when God comes to move you when God comes to change your position when he comes to do a shift in your life are you ready are you ready will you recognize the move that God is trying to um do in your life and so today our scripture right our scripture today that I posted I use many different versions of the Bible I look at different translations the translations that I normally post are the CSB version. I want to read to you the NLT version this morning. The NLT version, Proverbs 3, um, 5 and 6, a very familiar verse. Trust in the Lord with all your heart, with all your heart, everything that you have. Do not depend on your own understanding. Seek his will in all you do, and he will show you which path to go. So my question and what I wanted to come on here real quick to say was, will you under, will you recognize when God is saying, I want to move you from this location to this location in the natural and in the spiritual? Will you recognize the movement that God wants to do in your life? We have to we have to lean into him and say, God, I see you. I hear you. What, where do you want me to move? What do you want me to do? Because sometimes it will happen this quick in an instant. When I promise you and I tell you, when, we, when you lean into your relationship with God, when you seek him, when you talk to him, when you ask him, God, what do you want me to do? He will move instantly, rapidly. In the last 24 hours, in the last 24 hours, when I tell you that God has moved incredibly, expeditiously, swiftly, on my behalf saying, Nicole, no longer do I want you to be here, but I want you to be here. It's movement. It's quick. It's rapid. But we have to be in tune with our father. We have to lean into him and we have to know when it is him. And how do we know? See, sometimes, yes, I go to God in prayer about all things, but there are some things, right, that I don't need to pray about because I'm already in tune with him. I'm already in relationship with him. He and I are this tight so that when something comes to me, when something is asked of me, I don't need to say, well, let me go ahead and pray about it because my relationship with him is so tight that I can give the yes because I'm already hearing from him. As the question is being asked, God is already giving me a peace and saying, yes, I am. This is me that is moving you. This is my desire for you. Go ahead and say yes. And when I tell you that in the last 24 hours, there have been at least three things that have been presented to me that will move me from one place to another that will change my location. I'm not talking about physical location. I'm talking about spiritual location. I'm talking about my relationship with him, where I am in the kingdom of God, that there is movement going on, but we have to be in tune with our father and we have to know that it is his desire. And when we stay this close and this tight to him, sometimes we don't need to go into prayer. Sometimes God is saying, yes, this is me. You have my permission. You have my peace about this situation. Go ahead and say yes. But my question to you today is, will you recognize the movement when God is trying to change your position and move you from one place to another?
Amen. Amen. I love y'all. Um, thank y'all for your support. If you um, still have a desire to come to Becoming a Butterfly, tickets will be on sale until Monday. If you're not really sure what I'm talking about, go back through the page. Go back through the videos. I thank y'all for being here. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you throughout the rest of this week. Remember to use your key of movement and recognize when God is trying to change your location. Why? Because it's all a part of us becoming whole for real. Have a wonderful day, everyone. I love y'all and I will talk to y'all soon.